A big thanks to all of my Patreon supporters, and a big thanks to all of these donators of $5 or more, including An Enthusiast, BrianD0313, Dead Zergling, Dragon RPGM Mag, Radio Raptor, Vlad Tepish3176, and Wretch435. You're all helping to make these episodes possible. Howdy, insufferable gaming fans. Your old pal Rosser here with some more Al Kadim, the Genie's Curse. Last time, I believe last time I went down a well in order to try to find something and it was after journeying to an island where there were a bunch of sick and dying people and I speculated that this might be the final dungeon, though on second guessing I'm not sure at all, but hopefully this will do the trick. We still have some evils to defeat, someone controlling the genies, presumably the Sultan. And I have myself some nice whiskey and coke. And also, I'm destroying any chance these people had at a normal life by wrecking all of their supplies. I should probably feel ashamed of myself, but I don't. Alright. Hello. I'm capable of using the attacks in here, so I knew there would be enemies. What I don't know is the best way to defeat them. Hmm, this isn't working as well as it used to. Must be another Corsair. Wait, what was that old saying? Don't mess with shirtless men. Well, I seem to have triumphed nonetheless. So that's good. That was a hard-fought battle, though. I'm, I was impressed with the level of competence in that foe. Too many more like that, and I'll have to start thinking of a more efficient way to defeat them. Which, let's face it, probably ought to have done that in the first place. Right, I should probably be on the lookout for secret doors as well. Those tend to be a thing. Okay, we got more. More likely to actually hit them from the side. Okay, well, this is, um... Not safe, so what can I use? I got some fire arrows. Sun dazzles, some water blasts. Hmm. I never can remember what does what, but this looks like a pretty big beefy attack. And probably ought to heal up just a hair. Done and done. Yeah, boom. Boom! Get wrecked. Okay, I should probably save some, because... I'll need more, I'm sure. I also seem like I'm charging up a lot faster lately, so that's neat. Back to regulars. I got two Sun Scorches left. I wonder if that's across all three of these inventory items. Probably. Alright, back to it. Let's see, this was the way back to the start. I, I should know that since we were just there. Fighting powerful foes. Competent foes. 
All right. Try to get him at an angle. That seems to sort of work. Uh, until recently was working. Aha! There we go. Okay, that time went better. So, what have we discovered? An empty room! Oh joy! And pots to destroy. I do like shattering pottery. In the future we'll know that we don't need to go into that room. Let me guess, another dude... Oh, a branching path. You hear coarse laughter and rough arguing to the north. The guard is daring another to break into the west dungeon and take on a massive Etten trapped there. Oh ho ho, there's a massive Etten trapped in the west dungeon? The sign says, Attention mercenary barbarians, the western catacombs have not been secured. Do not venture beyond this point. Um, the door is so well spiked shut that it will never open. Aw oh, man, I was going to release the Etten and have it rampage. Ooh, flame arrows. Extra healing. Regular healing. 15 gems. Cone of cold. This is all good stuff. All right. We got ourselves a windfall. Ooh, all right. Well, I guess I'm going to have to go up there and fight the Etten. Or not the Etten, the guards. The guards that were going to release the Etten. Don't mind me, fellas. I am but a simple swordsman. A simple Simon swordsman. I have gotten myself backed into a corner. Fortunately, if I just keep moving, I'll be able to dodge more attacks. And keep twirling! And try not to attack until I'm at that angle. Excellent. Uh, ho -ho. Must have critted that one. Now where to? Ooh! Empty bottles. Those could can be used to contain a variety of things. Like water. Booze. Hmm, do I want to head that way first? Or do I want to keep exploring? I think it goes without saying that I should do some more exploring. Oh, hi. The captain of the mercenary barbarians leaps to his feet. Who are you, he demands, and how did you get here? I am Steve Alhazred, and I offer you one chance to survive. Surrender immediately! Another Alhazred. Well, I laugh at your offer. These are my finest warriors, and we greatly outnumber you. You will find only death here. Oh, yeah? Let's see him make it- Oh my god, they made it through the doorway! That's awful. But, they're very slow and clumsy. Which is good for me. Oh, ho, ho. Being cocky worked out for me, I guess. What now? Feel my blade, Alhazred. Ah. Uh, feel this, he said, whilst brandishing his junk. And by junk, I mean items. Which are things that you brandish. Ah. Uh, let's try a uh, Sunfire. Is that the one that does even all screen damage, or... I can never remember. Yep, that's a big ol' explosion. Uh, you see a huge, exquisitely beautiful gem on the table. It pulsates with an inner light. I mean, that's cool. Oh yeah, okay, that, I only had one of those, period. Uh, wrong. Use the right button. I guess, uh... I have to re-equip the gym every time. Okay, I've still got another one there. I'm somewhat understanding what's going on. Maybe I am, maybe I'm not. 
I don't even know. You get the fire arrows. They're quicker than the sling, so... Using fancy footwork while doing this. Did I break that gem? I think I broke the gem. I'm sad that I broke the gem. That might have been a problem. Or, I should say that will become a problem in the future. Most likely. I didn't mean to break it, it just kind of happened. The scroll says, The current group of prisoners will last up to another two weeks before their life energies have been completely drained. A list of 12 prisoners follow. Your brother's name is on the list. There is one name in the middle crossed out. Oh, shit. Rusty iron cell is tightly locked. Okay, I should probably go back and explore that other area in case there are prisoners there, in that case. Yeah, these guys right here. I can't let them have their way. Especially since they reset to their spot. And I can just bait them out and get one hit in at a time. Thank you, AI exploits. You're my best friend. I should probably be a little more conscientious of what I'm actually doing. Wait a minute. I'll just sling at him. I wonder if it's working. I'll give this a second. Yep, it must have worked. Got him. Sweet! And this is rusted tightly as well. Well, alas. Oh, shit. There were more of them. There's always at least one more, isn't there? Do that. Um. Keep being challenged. This is why I went back and bought all those potions. For an occasion such as this. And I'm glad I did. Very glad indeed. The sign says, Attention, not allowed, lest you enrage the monsters. Act under that is a newer note which holds an order. Check door spikes every night. The beast attempted to break through again. Cool. Yeah, yeah. Okay, I guess um, I didn't really need to fight all those dudes. Still wish I could have saved that gem. This looks to be a mage's chambers. So it does. Mage chambers. There we go. Uh, crap. Something about a mirror, I guess? It is the face of a scowling mage. He looks directly into your eyes and says, By the dark gods, you are not Captain Iskar. Who are you? Speak up, lackey. Um. Hmm. I am Steve Alhazard. Who are you? The mage's face grows pale in the reflection, and a moment of fear flashes across his angry countenance. Alhazard? Alhazard the Younger? How have you come to be there? Um. Just passing through! How have you come to be there? Uh. Goodbye. 500 gold, a potion of invulnerability and giant strength. Under the bed you find 500 gold and a rusty iron key. Let's see if I can get this message again. Ah, oh, alas. No. Well, I can always load. And see what exactly he did say. He might release the Etten if I'm not, uh... If I egg him on. Dim reflection of a face peers back at you from the murky water in the terrain. There we go. Okay. Who are you? Just passing through. 
What? That makes no sense. Speak sense, callow youth. This will make sense. I am coming to destroy you. No one can destroy us. The mage turns away quickly, and his image fades from the murky water. You now see only your own reflection. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Alright. So, prisoners to the east, potentially an Etten to the west. Do I want to bother going after the Etten? I should probably... Wait, the door shakes and the spikes loosen. That's not what I wanted. The spikes fall out and the door opens. Okay. Well, I just had to shake it a bit. Apparently. That is not a damn etin. I don't know what it is. Some kind of weird ass damn thing. I'll tell you that much right now. Two weird ass kind of things. Hmm, I wonder if I'm even doing any damage. Yes, I am. Alright. Going through here is an option now. I still should check with the prisoners first. Aw, oh, really? Really? That's... that that got me. I wasn't even sure he was doing any damage. Well, that was entirely my fault. I'll chalk that up to hubris. All right, all right, all right, all right. <laughs> I am destroying your prison and liberating those you unjustly imprisoned here. <laughs> the mage begins to tremble. His jaw quivers as he tries to speak. That was the best one. We are too powerful. The nameless masters will prevail. You are without honor and you will die without honor. The mage shakes violently, apoplectic with rage. Okay. That was a fun one. I think I'll save it on that one this time. Just so we don't have to go through that dialogue again. Let's try opening up some stuff over here. Rusty key fits the lock. Prisoner in the cell looks gaunt and haggard. Hi, you. You are free to go now. The villagers above have ceased their war and should be able to aid you. Thank you. I am so weak. I would have not lived much longer. I've earned XP. Hot damn. Run free, prisoner. The prisoner in this cell looks nearly dead. You are free to go now. Thank you. I will make it out. I know I will. Good. You see your brother in the squalid cell. He looks haggard and emaciated, as if the cell were stealing his very life essence. The brother looks pale and drained, but manages a weak smile. Whew! Finally, I can get to the bottom of this. What happened? Nah, I'll be nice to him. Well, that's probably a stupid question. Yeah, what happened? He points to his throat and writes in the spilled blood on the dungeon floor. Oh, I guess they cut his vocal cords. He writes, they stole voice, cannot summon genie. Good to see you. Those vermin will pay for what they have done to us. How can we get your voice back? The brother again draws in his own blood the picture of a flask and the name Abalat Isle. So I've got another island to go to. Well, prisoner looks to be faring well. We're free to go. All right, I managed to hide this gem from the guards. It is all I have and it is yours. Cool, cool. I do like getting gems. This prisoner is babbling madly. Well, 
I can't really just leave him in here. Whee! Okay. It's good. We could. We cool. Uh, guys? Oh. That guy's, um, hosed. You are free to go now, etc. And more XP, which I love. Screwed up their pathing algorithms. Okay. So, should I try that room full of... A wizard appears south of me. Oh shit. Hey, stop that. Knock it off. Good thing wizards don't have many hit points. There we go. Aha! Day is mine! But yeah, should I mess with these areas? The left to the left. And I think I will, just to see what's in them, because you all want to know what's in them. Don't pretend that you don't. I know you do. Hmm. Okay. Can't get through that one. But I was able to get through some other ones. Through spikes and whatnots. There we are. A little more. Now this time, I'll stay back and only try to enrage one of them at a time. Or try only to enrage one of them at a time. Good idea, huh? You know what? I could just do this. Yeah! <laughs> Got a little close. It's alright. I can keep this up and get a free kill, probably. This is the part of the job I love. And now, all I gotta do is wait and get that one. Good time for a drink. Did I get him? Nah. Just needed to step a little closer, that's all. Not what I was going for there. Obviously. Hey, gems. I like gems. What else we got? I can move those rocks. Which is a bad idea. Um... Why not? Eating up an Etten is, you know, probably good for my reputation, if nothing else. You're not netting. You're a damn spider. Stop being a damn spider. It is forbidden. I see treasure. That's the advantage of going this way, getting treasure. Now those spiders, those are a little big to be fitting through the door. Just maybe a pixel too wide. Maybe it's more their pathing. Those appear to be mummies. 
How about up here? What do we got? What do we got? Bats. Or a reasonable facsimile thereof. Mummy's really wrecked my shit the last time I played Neverwinter Nights, which admittedly was a whole lot of years ago. You ain't gonna do nothing. You ain't coming over here. Okay, you are coming over here. Fine. Color me incorrect. That's fine. Keeping my distance from these guys is a very good decision. Just slinging rocks. Where they land, I do not know. Urger. Urger. Ur yourself. Aha! Pants? Why did you drop pants? Is that evil wizard turning villagers into monsters? He ought not to do that, it's bad for them. It's bad for him, too, because that's just going to piss me off. louder. These can't be actual mummies. Lesser mummies at most. But not greater ones. If these were greater mummies, I would have been dead before I even made it here. Because they're master spellcasters. Greater mummies. Healing potions and whatnots. There was another room of mummies and chests, wasn't there? I'm going to want to go back and get that other room first, probably, but instead, I'm doing this. Where's the Etten? I was told there would be an Etten. Ah, crap. I didn't hear what it said. Wait a minute, I want to see what it says. Also, that is most certainly an Etten. That's what the people came here to see. I wonder if I can outmaneuver that thing, or if I should just use spells. Didn't say anything. Yet and sees you. Well, no shit. I kind of expected that it would. Wow. Okay. So. Etten's pretty tough. I'm gonna have to either leave it alone or find a way to kill it. Without getting close to it. Because, holy shit, that was two hits. Hmm. But it's got a treasure chest. Everybody likes getting treasure chests. I certainly do. Alright. Terrible idea. Let's get healed up. Let's get some weapons ready. Sunfire's a pretty good one. Don't forget to dodge! And this thing's quick. 
Very quick. Aha, I got it. Once. Shit, 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 shit. Damn. Well, I don't think I can take the Etten. So that's, that's a, that's. But I want to see what it's got in its chest. Maybe I can outmaneuver it long enough to grab the item. See, if the Potion of Invulnerability worked, this wouldn't be a problem. But it doesn't. Yeah, yeah. Gimme. Gimme, 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 gimme. I can't get it. I can't get the chest. Maybe that chest was not meant to be gotten at all. Maybe it's just like, okay, you opened the Etten cage, now you're dead. Up yours, buddy. Duly noted, I won't mess with it anymore. I could have loaded one earlier and not had to walk as far. But I didn't. I could probably make a trap for it using these rocks. But how, exactly, to do it? Ah, maybe he wouldn't be able to get through such a... Nah, he would. He'd clip right through it. I kid myself. I know how these things work. I'm not surprised there isn't something here, though. Seems like there would be. Maybe I'll learn more about this later. I'm also coming the walls, hoping to find some sort of not a bat. I certainly wasn't trying to find a bat. I was gonna say secret door, or secret room, that kind of thing. Mummy, 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 mummy. I fought skeletons, zombies, mummies, and ghouls. Now I'm just waiting for a vampire to show up. Maybe a lich. We need a lich before we're done. I wouldn't put it past the game at this point. It was a mirage? Well, shit. Well, that one was full of good healing, so that's cool. Alright. Good, 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 good. I guess now we can just kind of zigzag on back and head towards that new island. Pity, I would really have liked to have had a shortcut there. But today was not the day. I think I got all the guards. I got some gold. Or gold is a good thing. I forget to mess up this stuff. No reason to do it, other than pure damn spite. I want to make sure another wizard doesn't pop out when I'm on my way back, because that could happen. It happened earlier. Is there anything over here? Was this a dead end? Not a dead end, however... Yeah, it was. Yeah, it was. Okay. I guess that's all that was down the well in the evil prison. Yes, I wish to climb back to the surface. You must leave with your brother. Um... Did he not come with me? Son of a... Let me guess. He got caught on a wall all the way back near the beginning. Is that... is that what I'm... 
Understand? Yep. Okay. Well, it wasn't. That could have been worse. That could have been a lot worse. Come on, bro. We're getting out of here. Do -do 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 -do. Can I go one game without another escort mission? Doesn't seem likely these days, does it? The kids do love their escort missions. Giggity go. Your brother follows you up the stairs. Good. I would expect him to at this point. All right. What are we looking at? Have the people stopped raging at me? Cannot explore the island. Your brother is too weak. He motions to the sea. All right. I guess we're going to have to escort this guy all the way back to the boat. Escort mission. All right. Well, I guess we'll get to that next time. Until then, thank you all for watching. Clearly my prediction of beating the game this time wasn't even close, but who knows where it'll go from here. Until then, this has been your old pal Rosser. Take a drink. <laughs>